Assalamu alaikum everybody, this is your own inspired analyst and today we are going to talk about Thornchain or Rune. As you all know that Rune is one of my favorite projects and it's my second biggest holding in crypto. But there is something that you should know about Rune. If you have bought Rune on any decentralized exchange like Trust Wallet or if you have bought it on an exchange, you need to convert that Rune into the native Rune. Since I'll be sharing my screen so you will not be able to see me facing the camera, let's go ahead and talk about what Rune is. Ranking at number 50. If you look at the price of the room for the past uh, two years, it has gone at a higher level of about $20. It went up to $20 and then again at high value of almost $16 and currently trending at $8. And Thonchain is a decentralized liquidity protocol that allows users to easily exchange cryptocurrency assets across to a range of networks without losing full custody of their assets in the process. In simple words, if you want to swap Ethereum to Bitcoin, or if you want to swap Bitcoin to BNB or BNB back to Ethereum, you can do it all using Rune, which is why Rune is trying to solve the biggest problem in crypto. You can also check their website, which is thoughtchain.org and read about what their token is trying to do, what is their ecosystem. Now let's take a look at why upgrading to native Rune is so important right now. Many of the large Thornton influencers such as Rune Ranger and Thorn Maximalist, who the Thornton treasury has had no relation with ever, likely acquire Rune in this manner. So what they're trying to say is that Rune was available on a Trust Wallet and you could, you could have used BNB to buy Rune. It was not native Rune. Similarly, you could have used your Ethereum to buy Rune, which was available on Ethereum blockchain. Now, Thorn Chain is extremely strict in having no third party dependencies, preferring to manage everything in house. So they don't want to have third party integration. The plan will be to code support for Kill Switch. The Kill Switch, once activated, will slow reduce the redemption rate of 1 to 1 to 1 to 0 over 12 months, which means if you're holding any rune, which is not native rune, you will be given a chance to convert that 1 to 1, which means if you have uh, BNB rune or if you have Ethereum rune, you can convert it to native rune and for each rune, you get one native rune. But after 12 months, you will not be able to convert it. Yeah. If, if you look at Yaniv tweet, there's a plan to reduce the redemption rate to 1 to 0 over next 12 months, meaning that after 12 months, you will no longer be able to convert Ethereum or BNB Rune to native Rune. So this is very much important. You need to do it right away. There's this article as well uh, on Medium where they're talking about upgrading to native Rune. Uh, you can go ahead and read this article. And there's another article that's written by ThorSwap.Finance. And they've talked about how to convert uh, Rune to native Rune using Trust Wallet. So for the purpose of this video, I'm going to use my Trust Wallet and show you how I'm going to convert it. So this is the website that you need to come to, which is app.thorswap.finance. So I'm showing you my phone. I'm going to show you my Trust Wallet. I don't have much money in it. So if anybody is trying to do something wrong, uh -huh, don't do that. Uh, as you could see, I have a total of $9,229 uh, room that you see here on my Trust Wallet, which is 231 rune. Um, I need to convert this 231 rune, which is uh, on Binance chain, to the native rune. And I already converted uh, 4.7 rune earlier for testing purpose, and I'm going to do it now. So, what you need to do is make sure you, that you have at least $5 in BNB. If you do not have BNB, you will not be able to convert your rune to native rune because once you send your rune, uh, from your trust wallet to the ThorSwap, you you will be needing BNB to convert it. So make sure you have some BNBs. Right now I have about 3.16 BNB, which is equivalent to $1,300. So in order to connect my trust wallet with ThorSwap, I'll show it to you what I need to do. So on the website itself, here you can see the option of connect. Just click on that. And you can see a lot of integration for XD5 wallet, Terra Station, MetaMask wallet, Connect Ledger. If you have your rune in Ledger, you can connect your Ledger as well. But since I have Trust Wallet, I'm going to con uh, I'm going to connect it. And since I'll be using BNB chain, so I'll select BNB right here and click Connect. This is giving me a wallet compatible wallet. So what I need is my wallet to be connected. So in, in, in settings, if you can see there my phone, I come to the settings on the top right corner in the bottom and click on 
wallet connect as you could see here yeah this option right here which is wallet connect new connection and simply use it with the uh, scanner and it's showing me that Thorso app wants to connect to your wallet just connect it and this is connected and I, I want to see if my BNB is showing in my wallet on Thorso app let's click on the wallet yes it shows me I have uh, BNB which is 0 0.02 as I shown you uh, I have rune 231 so these rune I need to convert uh, this is BAP20 which is on Binance chain I need to convert it to native so on the right you see the option here uh, these two arrows it's for swapping you click on swapping and since I want to convert all of them I click max 231 but recipient address this is the address that you know it took me a while to find this information you'll not be able to find it on Google if you try to do it yourself um, I'll show you in my app so go to the trust wallet and where it says receive click on receive and click rune among the three runes that you see the one in the middle is the thorn chain which is a native rune I click on native rune and from here I copy my address so this is the address that I copied and I am going uh, to my wallet address and pasting it there but since I have to connect it to my computer let me send this on uh, WhatsApp to my wife okay I copied it and now here an option of editing it and I change it and I edit it says that it's even address is correct and since I'm connect, converting all of them 100% this is the transaction fee if you do not have it you will not be able to convert it so make sure you have that BNB click upgrade address is sure and confirm and it's going to show you an option on your trust wallet as well so open your trust wallet it's asking to confirm the transaction just hit confirm right here just hit yes confirm on the right you can see upgrade 231 rune for native rune let's see what happens just give it a while it will get connect uh, it will get converted it, it shows upgrade 231 bnb rune for native rune it's converted right here it shows now let's go back to our wallet address and see if it came back to rune oh thorn chain on the top on the second you can see now is 236 rune it's showing me that all my rune which was uh, BNB rune got converted into native rune so I'm happy that you know now my runes are safe and secure and there's nothing else that I need to do here so this was a simple process that I showed you but definitely make sure that you have BNB available and when you're converting it you're writing the right address from your trust wallet when you're converting it into native rune also if you do not have trust wallet if you bought rune on any centralized exchange like Binance so make sure that your rune that you bought on Binance is the native rune if it's not the native rune if it's the BNB rune transfer that amount in BNB to ThorSwap and using BNB convert that BNB and buy native rune and send it back to the Binance or on Binance you can use your rune uh, and send it to ThorSwap and, and as I showed you to swapping it just swap it back to native rune and send it back to Binance this is the way you can convert it and if you have any questions Comment on this video and I'll make sure to respond uh, to any of the questions that you have. And don't forget to like, swallow, 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 and don't forget to like and subscribe.